Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be unboxing all of our picture books for Blossom and Root, Level 3, Wonders of the Animal Kingdom. And I have my six-year-old here to help me. So go ahead and pull those books out. So all these books that we're going to be showing you today, I got from Thrift Books. So pull all the books out. So that's the first one. Exploring the Dark Deep Sea. Oops, turn it up. It's upside down. I'm really excited about this book. It's called Marshes and Swamps. You can put it on top of the other one. Okay, next. What's that one called? Um, is it called Ducks? Yeah, it's called Ducks. And as you can see, a lot of these are from Gail Gibbons, which we love. Grizzly Bears by Gail Gibbons. Okay, next one. This is one book, yeah. So thrift books is kind of like Amazon in terms of you have third-party sellers, so that's why we have a lot of different um, packages here. Okay, pull that one out. Ooh, a day at the salt marsh. Put it a little bit more so they could see the bottom. Yeah, good. That one sounds exciting, huh? It's kind of like what we just read about. Yeah. Okay, next. Well, so, go ahead. What were you going to say? The bottom one looks very heavy. Yeah, the bottom one. I think there's a box in there. A box? Yeah. Um, so, I got these books when they were having a sale on children's books, which was buy two, get one free. And there was also a 20% off sale. So, in addition to that, I tried to make sure all the books were $5 or less. What do you think that one's about? Uh, birds? Yeah, this one's about hawks, and it's by Jim Arnosky. He's the one that wrote Rabbits and Raindrops. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next. What do you think this one's about? Lighthouses. Yes. What's that one about? Ducks. Yep, it's called Ducks Don't Get Wet. What do you think that one's about? Climbing and going in a cave. Yep, caves and caverns. What are caverns? Um, a type of cave. Ooh, what's that one about? Snakes. What kind of snakes do you know? Rattlesnakes? Yes, it's vapor. called about all about rattlesnakes. And they're vapor? Yeah, and they're um, venom. Va and vapor. Okay. Turn that one over, that's the back. Oh, what's that about? What's that? Crocodiles. Close, it's about alligators, and it's also by Jim Arnosky. There's the tail. Yeah. Okay, what's this one about? Frog. Yep, also by Jim Arnosky. Mm -hmm. This is what we're going to be doing for your science next year. Are you excited? Me? Yeah. Yeah. This is called All About Amphibians, and this one's by Catherine Sill and John Sill. You don't have to worry about covering that sticker. That's from Thrift Books. Mm. Okay. Oh, what's this one about? Cat. Yes. We should show our cat that Yeah. One. She'll probably want to read it. Or... Yeah, you, think you could read that book to our cat probably by next year. Uh-huh. Next year, will I be in first grade? Yep. This is going to be your first grade science. Mm -hmm. Oh, this one's about horses. Yeah, this is about wild ponies, and it's by Jim Arnosky. Oh, look, there's little fish that look like Mima. That's right, those are clownfish. Do you know what this type of area is called? The coral reef. Yes, it's coral reefs. Very good. I'm excited about that one. And then turn, oh. the, turn those two over. What are those about? One at a time. Turtles and bats. Here, let's show them both. So this is Bats by Gail Gibbons. And that's... Turtles. All About Turtles by Jim Arnosky. Next. Oh, this one's wet. The next two look very heavy, but the third one is not so heavy. Okay. Right, next. We're going to take those out. This one's called Slither and Crawl by Jim Arnosky, and it's about different reptiles. Yeah. Okay, next. 
This one's called All Night Near the Water by Jim Arnosky. Mm -hmm. I think it's about what those animals do at night. Wow, is this a porcupine? Close, it's a beaver. A beaver? Yeah, The Beaver's Busy Year, and that's by Mary Holland. That's weird. <laughs> Next is a super giant heavy one. Yeah. Okay. What's that too? Let's see what's in here. Yeah. Okay. okay. And so a lot of these you can see are old library books. So this is called Thunderbirds by Jim Arnosky. Next. This is called Planet Earth Inside and Out by Gail Gibbons. I think this is a um, Memoria Press book. I think that's why I got it. Is this so what is this about, do you think? Hmm. Maybe if I show a few pictures. Yeah. Or just. What is it? A fox. Close. A husky. It looks like a husky. What are wild huskies called? Wild huskies. That aren't dogs. Wild husky. Wolves. What is it? Yeah, wolves. And it's one whole day, so I'm assuming it's like the storyline of a day of a wolf by Jim Arnosky. And then this one is by Jim Arnosky, and this is the Crinkle Root series, and it's about tracking. So I thought that you guys would be interested in learning about different animal tracks. See, look, there's a beaver building a dam. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next, what's this about? Whales. Or... Yep, whales, that's right. Mm -hmm. This that's is about, about muskrats. Them. Oh, I said. Yeah. I thought it was about anything. Looks kind of like um, off -way Next water. is sharks and lizards. Yep. Hammer sharks. Yeah, all different sharks. You excited to learn about sharks? Yeah. That looks like a poster one. Yeah, this is a thin book. Some of these are paperback books. That's what the soft ones are, are called. They're paper books. Paperback. They're like soft, like this. Bendy. Oh, and what's this about? Ducks? Yeah, water birds. So it's going to be some about ducks and some about other um, water birds. Remember, what's the one that we just learned about? Do you remember what it's called? Waterbirds? Remember in that book, the seashore book? What uh, was that bird that was eating fish? Uh, I don't know what it's called. It was a sandpiper. Yeah. That's another water bird. And what's this about? Owls or something? Yep, owls. That's right. Is that Jim a Oski. butterfly? I don't know. It looks like one, huh? Maybe that's just the light of the watercolor. Maybe it is that. Okay. Wow, this next one is super big, Mom. Yeah, we'll do that one next. Okay. So, see, this is a hard pack. Pull that one out. Ooh, what's oh, what's that about? Star. Yep. Ooh, this is a Thanksgiving book, it looks like. What is it about? What animals? Turkeys. Yep. Oh, look at that one. Ooh. You know what type of bird that is? Uh, no. This is called a heron. Look at the back. Yeah, the There's back has different things. books. So this is called Henry the Impatient Heron, and it's by, uh, can't read the author, Donna Love. This is another type of a water bird. Okay. What, oh, oops, I accidentally got two copies of All About Owls. Hmm. Whoops. <laughs> Okay, and this one's called Grandfather Buffalo. And this one, I think, was also recommended by Simply Charlotte Mason for Nature Study, so I was excited to find that one. Wow. Okay, now the biggest one that yet. One. Okay. This is a... I think there might be a box in here. We'll have to check that out. I don't think so. You don't think so? Yeah. Oh, you're right. No box. I was right. Okay. I think it's definitely not. Okay, them out one at a time. Do you this, know what those are? Uh, otters. These are manatees. What are manatees? They're kind of like seals a little bit. Oh. Eagle, seagulls. Close, eagle, that's right. This is by Gail Gibbons. Next. Ooh, turtles. What? Okay, slow down for a second. What kind of turtle is it? A turtle. Where does it live? 
in the coral reef. Yeah, sea turtle. Okay. Next. Take our time, okay? What's this uh, one about? A key peacock. Yeah, this one's about show off animals. It's called Look at Me, and then what's the tagline? I can't read it. Look at Me, Wild Animal Show Offs by Jim Arnosky. That's because they're prettier than they are. Okay, next one. Okay, what's this one? Um, about turtles. Yeah, and turtle in the sea. So that'll go along with that other sea two turtle. Two Z O E Y. Yeah, that says two who. What's that name? Zoe. Yeah, just like your friend. Two Zoe. Oh, what's this one about? Do you think? Snakes, rattlesnake. Yep, it's another rattlesnake book. Okay. We already pull that one out. We already have. No, I think we got it from the library. Yeah, but I have another one. Okay, well, yeah. what's it about? Horses. And it's by Gil Gibbons. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Okay. Next. This one I'm excited about. Seahorses? Yep. What's it says seahorse, the shyest. What does it say? What's the shyest. Yeah, we can look at it. The shyest fish in the sea. Let's see why, yeah, why you're look excited right. about it. I like seahorses. I think they're cool. Really? Because they can hold on to long grass. Well, they go through the things. I just think that they're interesting. You octopus. Ooh, seahorse again. Oops, careful. Mm. All right, next. That's the end. Wait. Right. Different types of seahorses. Okay. A couple more books. Mm. Oh, so many fish. Oops, did I get two of the same book again? <laughs> you got two of the Another same. one of One Whole Day of Wolves. Oops. <laughs> you got okay. two of the same book. Okay, and what's that one? Um, About dinosaurs? Yep. I think I, that one's either for the Memorial Press or just for fun. This Next one I'm also one. very excited about. It's about oranges and slurpy animals. Oh my it's called the Armadillo's Orange. And so this is for the part of the um, Blossom and Root study about armadillos. And I just thought it looked so cute. And that's, it's by Jim That's Ronofsky. enough pages for today. Yeah, that's enough. Okay. Left. I think there's two books left. I okay, thought so what's this one about? Bears. Aww. Yeah, it's called Tooth and Claw, The Wild World of Big Predators. And our last book for is today they, is... It's uh, about bears again. Yep, bears. it says every... Whoops! Every mm -hmm. Autumn Comes the Bear by Jim Arnosky, and we're all done. Yeah. Which book was your favorite? Uh, The orange one. You mean the one with the armadillo? You yeah. You thought that was cool? Why did you think that one was cool? Because there's oranges in it and the armadillo eats the orange probably at the end. Okay. This is right. the end of today's video. The end.